In its 10th edition, Jaipur Literature Fest has gone cashless. Let's talk to the producer of the show and find out how easy was it for him. Sanjoy, 10th edition and cashless. Uh, cashless was a brave new step. We thought given the situation today, uh, we needed to go digital. So hopefully this is going to work. Uh, like I said, it's a, it's a new thing. Across the festival, you can just load your, your wallet onto this card, which is quite simple and uh, from any of the loading stations and you can use this to buy everything from Moonfali to chai to books to merchandising. From peanuts to books and all you need is this card. So how are you going to uh, tell people that you can buy peanuts also with this? Well, hopefully you're going to tell people for us ki how or, uh, you can buy everything on this card. Okay, Sanjoy, now there's a there's now a shift also. The RSS would be having their representation for the first time. So why is this, this, this decision and how will it help the fest? It's actually not for the first time. You've covered the festival many times, so you should know the first time was actually when Tarun Vijay came, which was many years ago. So And every year we've had somebody or the other who actually comes to uh, the festival. So this is a continuation of our philosophy that this needs to be a, a platform for all kinds of points of view and one last question what is going to be different fr from the last festival because you've been coming up with different ideas so 10th something special well that's for you all to uh, wait and watch but freedom to dream is going to be a special sort of focus plus the 12 15 AD Magna Carta which is going to be on display Freedom to Dream is going to be special in this edition with cameraman Surendra Yadav. This is Vishal Beristu, DD News, Jaipur.